Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you do not know me, my name is Michelle and I do planner videos. So today I will be showing you my new and first uh, vendor spec cover and my first ostrich X uh, leather cover. So if you're interested, then keep on watching. So this, like I said, is my first uh, vendor spec and my first ostrich planner. I got this uh, a few weeks ago, but I ordered it back in the end of uh, 2020. And the reason why I got this, if I uh, give you a bit of background story, is that if you know me and you know my channel, you've seen that my covers are mainly Gilios and Gilio Crocos because that's uh, the, the type of cover that I like from Gilio. And I've always been drawn to Vanderspeck, but I must say that um, their website and the ordering process always seemed a bit too complicated for me, just because at Gilio, you see the planner that you like and you go buy it. At Vanderspeck, everything is, not everything, but most of the things are customizable. So you need to get the specs and details right uh, in order for you to order what you want. So I always shied away from that. And um, the main reason as well is because um, the Crocos, I do prefer the Crocos from Gilio than from Vanderspeck. And then the rest are um, just like plain covers that I stay away from. But this um, one was what really made me want to try out Vendor Spec. And I must say that at first I didn't like ostrich covers for the simple reason that they have uh, quills and I always thought that the look of it was a bit funny and I don't know, I was never into it, even with uh, Jillio's Ostrich, it never appealed to me. Until the moment where I saw uh, Sierra's, so SM Plants in uh, the planner community, get her personal wide in this color. This is the la lavender color and uh, in Ostrich, but hers is full quill because this is uh, an Ostrich X and I'll explain that a bit later but when I saw her planner I was like wow I've never seen a color like this and I absolutely love it so that's when I decided to look more uh, specifically into vendor spec for uh, getting this planner so in at the end I think it must have been in November 2020 I emailed Petra um, asking her if she had any ostrich x uh, in this particular color left and the thing is x means that it's the leftovers of the hide when you want to order an ostrich leather then you have to be with like another person in order for her to um, order the hide and then afterwards with the rest of the pieces then she can do um, planners or other accessories whatever you wish with uh, what's left and I didn't want a full quill because that of course is more expensive but also like I said I'm not very fond of uh, the look of the quills so initially I had asked her sometimes you have hides where well you see this one has mainly uh, quills but that, that, that they are flat but sometimes you have no quills at all and that's what I had initially asked her but she said she only had one height left and this was the one. So, and when I received the, the photo, I immediately fell in love with it. I don't know what is it, but with this color, the quills seem, they appeal to me. So I was like, okay, let's do this. And I placed the order, I think in December 7 of 2020. And before I did that, I, placed an order for samples and uh, let me show you the inside because even if it's uh, an ostrich X it's still a lot of money so I wanted to be sure that I really like the color and people were saying well 
there's no way there's no better way to know than to order uh, samples so that's what I did and uh, I ordered a bunch of samples even though I pretty much knew that this was the combination that I wanted but just to be sure so here is um, the back so this is the ostrich egg X um, lavender color and here is the touch me anthracite and this is a waiting list order which means that you have to be I think six uh, signed up for her to be able to uh, order the, the, the hide so that took a while because I think once you reach six people it takes another five weeks for for the hide to come in so, um, and when I got the samples, I knew that these colors would look really well together. So, I think I didn't mention it, but this is a B6 codex. So, it's mainly made for uh, my B6 Stalogy that I use as my personal daily planner. And um, I'll go um, through, I'll show you the specs. So, I got um, gold hardware here. Uh, this is mainly the, the the main layout of the B6 codex, which means like six card slots here, one bottom pocket, a slip pocket, two slip pockets, one for your cover and another one uh, where you can put uh, all sorts of stuff. And then the only things that I added was here a secretarial pocket on uh, the right. And then the pen loop, which I raised a bit for it to look like um, the Gilios, because in the Gilios, the, the pen loop is slightly raised, and I like that. Uh, the other thing is I ask for uh, a chunky clasp. And finally, I read, because I spent a lot of time on the, the Facebook group, and if you do not know that, or if you have questions, you can definitely check them out because uh, everyone on their group is very helpful and someone had told me that if um, your because initially the inside of your clasp is the color of the inside of your cover so here it would have been anthracite and someone mentioned that if the color is darker than your outside sometimes a color transfer could happen from here to this part uh, of your planner and because I knew this would be lighter I didn't want to take any chance and uh, ordered like the whole class in ostrich so that hopefully won't happen because it's the same material and uh, color so I got this uh, beginning of June so from December to June that was a huge wait time and I must say that it is not the normal uh, wait time for a custom like this the thing that happened is that I think it was ready sometime in March and Petra sent me some photos and this is one thing that if it's your first time ordering I would strongly suggest that you ask her for photos before sending it out because then um, it could avoid potential mistakes. Why? Because I had asked for that. She sent me the photos and then I noticed that there was something wrong with the pen loop. It was not where I had asked it to be. And I was like, oh, the, this doesn't look right. I emailed her and then she said, yeah, the, a mistake was made. And uh, I must say everything that I heard about Petra is a uh, hundred percent true she is amazing and very nice to work with every time i had any questions she would respond very quickly and so she was super proactive and she said no problem we will fix it uh, it would just take a bit longer because like i said this is a waiting list item a leather and uh, at that time she didn't have any anthracite so was like back on the list waiting for six people and then waiting for another five weeks for the leather to come in so in the end I only got it like five months later which is huge but it's okay 
um, she fixed it and uh, I thank her and her team because they were very uh, professional and their customer service is great so if you uh, order a custom ask for pictures that way if there's anything wrong with your planner then they'll be able to fix it there and then instead of having it sent out to you and then you open it opening it and realizing something's wrong and then it just avoids you the hassle of sending it back there and uh, and so forth like I'm in Canada and I did have to pay customs for this so like I would not like if it had come I don't think I would have sent it again because I just want to avoid like paying so much for for a cover so uh, that's that what else so let me sh put in the cover and I'll tell you what I enjoy so what I like about this cover is that it's super uh, compact and slim the thing is and I'll show you I have it here I have a B6 uh, Stalogy, oh no, a B6 Giglio Apunto, and this is way bigger than the Vendor Spec. You can see them, it's wider and a bit long, taller. So, and it never really bothered me, but you see here, I also have a B6 Stalogy, and then there's a lot of room for the planner, so much that you can actually fit in two uh, stylogies in here it's incredible but sometimes but it adds to the weight so one thing I like is that it's slimmer it's more compact and it's so light like I had heard people talking about ostrich leather saying it's super light and it's true um, I do not know how this will wear with time if you do have an ostrich planner please let me know but um, I'm super happy with that but I don't think you'll be able, like you can only fit one planner, it's, which is okay because I, I, I hardly never use two planners in this. So that's what I, something that I like. Um, what else? So I haven't had this long enough to do like a full review, but I'll be using this for um, the month of July. I'm, I'll be setting up one book July. And I'll be using this and uh, hopefully by the end of the summer or by the end of the year I'll be able to do a more complete review on how uh, I like it but I will be doing a video comparing uh, both of these planners because I know a lot of people always these tend to be the two main brands uh, in the higher-end planner community and um, often people ask well how the how do they compare so since I have both models of the B6 size, then uh, I will be doing a review on that. So if you're interested, then subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on that video. But uh, yeah, there, there is one thing though that um, I hear is I think there is foam inside of this cover. And whenever I close it, like it makes a, a slight like squeaky noise i don't know if you'll be able to hear it but yeah i i don't know does yours um do that as well i emailed petra she said that uh, there's nothing wrong it could just be air coming out but uh, let me know if you've had this and does it uh, stay forever because um, I mean it's nothing major but it's a bit annoying sometimes when I close a planner and it is sometimes quite loud so just let me know and uh, I'll see um, I mean there's nothing I'm going to do but uh, yeah so overall I'm super pleased with uh, this planner it was well worth the wait uh, and uh, yeah I cannot wait using using this the color is spectacular it it's uh, it varies like from direct sunlight to indoors it like changes color but it's super super nice and uh, yeah I'm very happy with it so thank you again Petra and the Van Respect team and uh, yeah if you like this video then subscribe and I'll see you in my next video thanks bye guys